channel this and that and in today's video I am beyond excited to share with you guys the process of me completely rearranging our furniture um, restyling um, and switching out artwork and all sorts of things like that just to make this video space new and open and the exciting and great thing about this is and what I want to get across to you guys is the point isn't to be spending money to redo a space. I am not spending any dime, at least today. I am going to show, share with you guys that just by rearranging your furniture, switching up your stuff, just by shopping your home can make your space feel new and fresh. Plus giving your house a really good deep clean will also help with that process. And that is exactly what I'm going to be doing in today's video. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy and let's just get right on into it. kitchen we have like this uh doorway here that leads into the space so when you walk in here is an overview and as you can tell it is a big open nice space to a certain degree however our living room is in the dining room and um i think i'll do a voiceover later on doing like a background history of the current situation why but as you see our living room is just in the dining room and i feel you walk in and it doesn't feel big and open and comfortable like it's supposed to be instead it feels cramped cluttered and i just hate having our furniture like this in this dark area i have a little table that's gonna go right here and then we have these um open shelves that i'm excited to restyle the dog crates would get shifted down and then we have our dining room table that's pushed over here that i'll move right off uh, right over into here in the middle of the space but then walking through over to what's supposed to be can i help you guys i don't know why they're like that here is the living room and again it's a really good size we have two windows here with two more windows on this wall with this hole built in on this entire wall um we have trees right there, so there's no cushions, but you can see the intent, and I feel like there's so much potential. I mean, we have lighting all the way around the entire room. We have these big, beautiful beams here in the middle, and then, like, over here, we even have, like, a big double door here. So the Alrighty, so first things first, I wanted to go ahead and clear everything off this pool table and get this pool table out of here, so that way I could start moving furniture over into the living room. Now that that pool table is good and gone, I am starting to move some furniture over into the living room, starting with this leather couch here, and you'll see me in just a bit bring over the other couch. So throughout this entire process of me rearranging furniture, I am vacuuming as I go. So whenever I move a piece of furniture, I'm making sure to vacuum underneath it because there's definitely a lot of dog hair underneath the furniture. Now I'm going in and bringing the dining room table into the dining room and getting that space all set up. on your own because 
I just did it all on my own. Although it had wheels, if it didn't have wheels, I probably would not have been able to move this and I was scooching it versus picking it up. That you cannot do on your own. Now that this bookshelf is going to be actually in the dining room and used as a dining room area, I want to remove all this random stuff, mostly arts and crafts stuff, find a new home for it, and I'm going to give this, these shelves a good cleaning and replace it with some photo albums which ends up looking really nice in my opinion and looking all cleaner. Alright, this is now all empty and cleaned. I did leave that though because I think that's going to stay there. Um, and I've started working on this. I'm happy with that for now. I wanted to start styling this. Um, again, just using what I have. I took everything off, put it on the table. Plus, I grabbed a few new things. I also have a, a thing there and, like, a couple things in that chair. As well as some things over here to work with. So, I'm just going to try to make it look the best I can using what I have. But, let's get going on this. start deep cleaning i know i probably should deep clean the entire house and then move furniture around but it's kind of been a mix of both moving and cleaning cleaning and like as i go so whatever it is what it is i'm just taking section by section basically and cleaning it so i'm gonna take everything off of that top shelf wipe it down put it back and I continue that process really deep cleaning this entire section and my thought is once I've done an overall deep clean in each section at the very end, once everything's in its place, I'll then do like one last kind of like vacuum and dust and clean just to really make sure everything is all good. But I'm going to start dusting and working on this area. At this point, I am coming to an end on day one, and I wanted to finish off day one by giving this entire wall a really good deep cleaning. As you see, I'm wiping down all of the shelves, taking everything off, wiping it down, then putting everything back, and I'm doing that to both sides, and making sure that this space is all nice and clean, so that way tomorrow I come in, I can style the shelves all night. progress yesterday i'll do a quick walk around just to give you an update tour i was up so late last night i'm pretty sure i forgot to film like me styling these shelves um but i was getting so like overwhelmed with uh the placement of things on the shelves there are aspects i like aspects i don't like especially at the dining room one i feel felt like i liked it and then i stepped back and i didn't like it so 
I'm very, uh, I was very stuck. So I went to bed, woke up this morning with fresh eyes, and I'm gonna do a little bit of working. I have one empty cubby just still style, and then other ones I still might um, adjust a little bit, but I've gone up, showered, had breakfast, gained some energy, and there is still a lot to do, you guys, but I'm just so happy with how it's looking, and I just feel so much better now that the space is back to the way it's meant to be. So I'll give you guys a quick update tour, and then we'll get to work. to finally put the space together, adding in those final touches. So I'm starting by wiping down the entire dining room table, and I didn't film this, but I did go around like all those side tables, coffee table, give everything a really good wipe down, and do one last third vacuum, and then adding in those final touches. And you'll see me in just a bit properly set this table, and I just made a went around and made sure the space was all nice and clean before presenting it to my parents. <laughs> Alrighty you guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video, and if you did, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up, consider subscribing, because I am having some video holiday videos coming out shortly. I'm gonna sign off here and let you guys enjoy the before and after clips. Bye!